so I might completely regret wearing this because it is actually quite warm but I'm just gonna see how long I can actually wear it for Hello everyone and welcome to Kimmy Shrines. If you're new here, then I do Disney themed videos. So the last one I did was actually what I got for my birthday. So if you've not seen that, please go check that out. And today I'm doing something from the shrine. So I thought I'd do something from the Jasmine range. Obviously it's Aladdin and Jasmine as well. Obviously you can see I've got a bit of genie on. But yeah, let's just get into this. So yes, this is actually from the uh, Aladdin film. But obviously Princess Jasmine is in it. So I'm going to show you some uh, Jasmine stuff that I've got. So one of the first things I'm going to show is actually this one here. So if you've seen my vlogs, you would have seen this on my sofa. I've got so many cushions, so many throws. Uh, so this one actually originally came from Primark but I didn't actually get it from Primark because I actually got it from the Facebook groups. Now um, if you see my videos for a while you know that I always link down below all the Facebook groups as anything you see in my videos or anything in general that you can't get hold of. I find eBay it's alright but you have to wait for someone to post something on eBay whereas on the Facebook groups you can actually ask for something. So I actually asked for this one and someone actually kindly said oh yeah I've got it to sell and they actually sent it to me. So it is a little bit hit or miss what's actually you know available to, to buy. I find it so much easier than going on eBay and then obviously like you know just pay for PMP, pay for the item but like I said I originally remember seeing this on the Primark uh, Facebook group. Couldn't get hold of it in my store so that's why I went on to the other Facebook groups where people actually go out because like for example there's so many bigger Primarks around there's actually people out there who can actually get to the bigger stores and actually get the items for you so just in case anything ever in my videos that you want to obviously get hold of and you can't I would say that's the best place to go so the second thing if you know I love my mystery mini so for me personally it's one of my favourite type of videos to do um, I do actually have I think in a high street video I've got coming up I've got a few mystery minis coming up uh, so one of the latest ones I did I actually got one of these now it actually came from I think it was the style I did actually write it down oh a uh, secret style to be honest I can't find anywhere the actual box because I like to keep the box can't find it anywhere to show you guys but basically they had a few se uh, series of them Whereas like different characters, so you obviously get what, one character and they're all obviously the princesses. Now I tend to get mine either for say like toys for a pound or say supermarkets like Asda. I did actually get this one from the Asda store and I think I got two characters and I'm trying to remember which other one was. <laughs> but like I said, yeah, I love mystery minis. Um, the fun thing about this is obviously it's quite squidgy so obviously it's safe for, for kids. But yeah, it's just one of those things because so, I recently did a mystery minis video just in case you missed that. That's why I thought I'd include it. But yeah, I just think they're really cool to to kind of have just like little figurines. I'm trying not to include Revolution every single one of my videos just because I'm like, not sponsored anyway but just the fact that Revolution team up with uh, Disney quite frequently. Now I am aware there's other Revolution makeups out there but if you know um, obviously I've just had my birthday I had to wait until after my birthday to know what I got to then buy the other stuff so I am fully aware that they've got a Rapunzel range um, obviously I need to get some more Lion King stuff they got a Moana range so it is on my list but just in case you're interested in the Jasmine one as uh, so they tend to do um, uh, eyeshadows, which is this one here. So it's almost what they class as a storybook. So they do eyeshadows and they do uh, like blushes and bronzers. Now, as you can see, I've not used this one. The reason being is because I actually use quite a lot of the other ones. So um, I will eventually get around to this one. Uh, my most used one is actually the uh, Cinderella one and the Tiana one. So nothing against this one. It's not like I don't like this one. It's just the fact that I, I'm going through the other ones. I don't want too many like on the go. So I'm trying to use up the other ones first. So like I said, so they got like things like this. Uh, other things they do are highlighters as well. So this one is uh, one that actually lives in my shrine. So again, if you've been watching my videos for a while, you'd actually see this one in the shrine. Just because it's not my colour, unfortunately, it's completely the wrong colour. Um, I personally bought it knowing that some of these items would actually go in the shrine. So it's just one of those things that I was like, I still want it for the collection. I just know I would never wear it. Um, also know what they did was a uh, lip gloss, uh, which is a blue one. So I'll just quickly ooh, grab it. So yeah, so that was uh, the blue one they got, which was the genie one. Um, again, no intention of ever using it, just because uh, it's not kind of the colour that I would use. It's a really pretty colour, it's just not something that I would use. So uh, again, it's one of those things that I purposely bought it for the shrine. Now, Revolution normally do, like, say, a three for two. Uh, you can also get stuff like this in Superdrug as well, because it's actually from the I Heart range. Not sponsored in any way, just thought I'd let you know that's where you can get them from. But like I said, I'm waiting for them to be, like, a three for two, or possibly in the cell to get the other items. 
Now, so I thought I'd actually move on to uh, like Aladdin stuff because obviously, like I said, because Jasmine is actually from the Aladdin film. So just in case you're interested in Aladdin in general in the films, that's what I thought I'd show you. Uh, again, what I got for my birthday. So just in case you missed that video. Now, Stitch Crashes. Um, I'm sure you guys are familiar what this was. So um, last year, every month, uh, Stitch from Lilo and Stitch actually uh, had a toy and a pin based on other Disney films. So this is the Aladdin one. So this was six of 12 which would have been June's one which I just realised now. <laughs> uh, I think this one, this video is actually going up in June or like late May. So it's very, yeah, so this is obviously almost a year old. Now, I got some of the uh, the actual toys of the plushies. So I actually got some of those. I didn't want all of them because obviously there was 12 of them. I actually ended up getting only six of them because for me, not every film I wanted. So for example, I've said this before, like there's a Pinocchio one, um, a Lady and Tramp one, Jungle Book, that kind of thing. I, I don't gravitate towards those kind of films. So I got, say, like Little Mermaid, Aladdin, um, uh, Lion King so I got those kind of um, plushies and I'm starting to get more pins and now this one like I said I actually got for my birthday but the reason why I requested this one is because Disney actually had a sale and this is one of the one items that was in the sale I don't know while filming this if they're still available but again on the Facebook groups I know a lot of people are actually selling off their pins and their toys either because to be honest they were quite expensive when they came out I think the the actual uh, toys were like 25 30 pounds and these ones were 20 pounds so i know a lot of people are trying to sell them off now and also because unfortunately it was very difficult to get hold of some of them some people wanted them for their collection couldn't get say one or two of them so now they're just selling them all off so these will still be available on the facebook groups like i said link down below not sponsored anyway it's just for me personally i find that sometimes the best way to shop around especially if you know there's an item you want you can ask for it so uh, and like i said i've seen so many people selling them of um so not not too expensive obviously ebay i have noticed that they're a little bit more double maybe even triple what they're worth so that's why i would suggest the facebook groups because you can kind of like bargain a little bit better with the the money or you can obviously go and collect as well so that's obviously an easier option but yeah it's just about like i said because this was in the sale that's why i thought i'd mention it so another thing that I got as well, which I got for Christmas, so you might have seen this in what I got for my Christmas, is a, a Funko Pop, which I actually <laughs> forgot I was with Ruben when I got it. So I was really surprised <laughs> when I opened it. I'm like, oh my God, I really want this. And he was like, yeah, I know you were with me when I bought it. So it's actually this one here, which is a Funko Pop of uh, Aladdin and Jasmine on the magic carpet ride. Now I had every intention of um, actually putting it somewhere because at the moment, I just put it on my desk and to be honest because I got this for Christmas it's actually been sat on my desk for like what five or six months now <laughs> and another thing is it's like it's so pretty like I don't want to take it out of the box because again I was just like oh it'd be nice to have it out of the box because you had to see it because unfortunately where obviously this bit is it's very difficult to kind of see through it and because it's quite detailed because obviously you've got two characters in there and I also got the, the magic carpet as well it is kind of difficult to kind of see through so I had every intention of like putting it around the house it's just at the moment it just lives up here Right, because this is a Jasmine video, I thought I'd actually include some of the items from the live action film as well. I don't have a lot of live action Jasmine. There wasn't really a lot around. I know a lot of things were like dolls and things, but it's just the fact that I never really personally saw a lot around. And I have a hair. Sorry, I can feel a cat hair. I... Thing I've got. Um, yeah, so I never actually saw a lot of um, live action Jasmine stuff, right? or even Aladdin. So from the film Aladdin, I didn't actually see a lot around. Um, so one of the things I actually saw, which I'm trying to remember where I got this from, this one here, and I'm trying to remember because I've actually seen stuff like this in a few different places. Like um, it might have been like say Toy Entertainer or Smith's Toys, or it could even be Asda because I know I've seen stuff like this in Asda before as well. Um, also Toys for a Pound, I know sometimes they do stuff on there as well. Uh, again, not sponsored, but that is again one of my little sort of favourite places to go because I kind of like interested and in see what they got. I tend to get a lot of my mystery minis from there because if you know me, I love my mystery minis, so I tend to get a lot of them from that one. I've actually got a few mystery minis coming up soon for you guys so obviously uh, I'll kind of filter them out over the next couple of months but yeah so I feel like stuff like this 
might not exist in stores now but again you can either go on Facebook groups or eBay that kind of thing so it's not something that would be too difficult to get hold of um, I'm not sure she come in different outfits because obviously this one is uh, one of the outfits that she wears in the movie but she does wear quite a few different ones so I'm not sure there was any other versions of her out there it's just the fact that I really like this one and I like the little lamp on the top as well so again if you know me I'm a sucker for packaging I really like the look of it so again I wasn't having any intention of taking out the packaging but I just thought it's quite a nice uh, design of her dress because you don't really get her in her live action uh, clothes that often and then the last one from the live action one was this one here so it's a Funko Pop but this is more what I class as her uh, a peacock one so again she had different outfits but I kind of feel like this is the one that was kind of more based on the animation because of the colouring because it's kind of got that, that greeny teal kind of colour it's obviously more detailed uh, for the movie so I kind of feel like this is the dress she's more known to be in like most of the merchandise was maybe her in this dress so that's why I wanted to get this one uh, they did have other characters as well from it which I have the Aladdin and Abu one and I've also got the Aladdin in his Prince Ali outfit so I've got those two as well but yeah again I didn't really see a lot of um, live action in this outfit even though there's loads of posters and loads of just like the advertising in her in this dress I didn't really see a lot of things uh, to buy so yeah so I thought I'd just do this one as a quick video because I know my last one was really long because obviously like I said it's what I got for my birthday so it was a long video so I'm trying to do sort of more like different um, um, different times so ones that are more like 10 15 minutes or sometimes I do obviously more like 20 minutes and sometimes I do ones over half an hour so I'm trying to do like different ones for you and also because this is really really hot <laughs> that I was just like yeah I don't think I can actually talk anymore so I thought I'd just make this a, a short video but yeah if you like this kind of videos then please give me a big thumbs up please like subscribe and all that jazz and I'll see you guys next time later days